we conceded too many in the first half um, and then it was an upwards battle really but I thought we responded really well obviously got a couple of goals before half time could have had a few more to be honest um, but yeah it was very transitional and I mean all preparations are now for next year so still got time to go back prepare and got another exciting game on Tuesday so yeah a lot to learn from well that looked chaotic at times and that's not a word we often use to describe this team and these performances yeah, I mean, like I said, it was quite transitional. Um, I thought we didn't keep the ball as much as we could have done. Um, yeah, we lost it too many times everywhere on the pitch. Um, I thought we could have been better. Um, we've been working hard to put that right in training this week, um, and unfortunately it didn't pay off. But there's so many positives to take away from that today. Um, and also we've got areas to learn from, and I think that's important as well. Um, it's not all sunshine and rainbows. So, yeah, we've got a lot to look forward to and a lot to learn from for next summer. But that was a really experienced team out there today. Is it one of those kind of gut check moments? You're like, actually, well, now we know what not to do. Now we've got to do better. Yeah, I mean, they're, it's all experiences for us. Um, yeah, every game's different. And I mean, like, like I said, we're disappointed with the score. Um, it could have gone either way at the end. I thought we created a lot of chances. I thought we were on top, um, especially in that second half for the majority of it. Um, but yeah, we showed parts of our game that we wanted to um, and other parts where unfortunately we didn't want to but like I said, it's a massive learning curve and yeah, I mean we've got a lot of experience in this team that we're going to be able to bounce back and hopefully put in a strong performance on Tuesday. And you haven't got long to sort of dwell on it, have you? Mm -hmm. No, of course not. Um, we've got a few days, uh, rest and recover. Um, obviously it was quite transitional so a lot of running backwards and forth but we want to try and nullify that for the next game. Keep it as much as we can and show the England what we want to. Thanks, Lauren. Thank you. Yep. Yeah. Lauren, that was an England performance that I don't think we've seen very often. Is it fair to say that the first half of the first half is the worst you've played since Serena came in? Um, I mean, I can't quite recall every single game that I've played in, but um, I mean, we conceded too many goals at the start, and like I said, it, it's an upfield battle from there. Um, but I think we responded really well. Um, I think it was too transitional at times and we could have kept the ball better but I mean there's a lot to learn from going into Tuesday and we've got such a quick turnaround that we've got to get it sorted quickly. What was going on defensively for this first three goals? Uh, I mean it's a mixture of everything like people up front we could have pressed quicker um, and then obviously it then runs through the team as well everyone's just a yard off it um, but yeah it's, it's little mistakes and I mean I haven't watched any of the goals back so I'm not quite sure what happened but it's something we'll learn from and yeah it, it's not often that we get goals conceded against us so I mean it's a credit to them. Sometimes you have to hit rock bottom to then stage a fight back. The fight back did come but what did you say to each other as a group in that huddle when you were 3-0 there? I think it's just to be positive. Um, that's all we could do really like they hated us going 1v1 at, in their backs so it was important to keep doing that, keep threatening and we created lots of chances. I think it could have been 4-3 to us at half time to be honest. Um, so yeah, it's about just being more clinical, taking our chances, but yeah, it was all positive messages, especially going into that second half, because we knew that we could go on and, and win the game. I think that's possibly the most animated we've seen Serena on the, the touchline. What did she say at full time to as a group of players? Uh, well, obviously stick together, look at the positives, and there's obviously a lot that we can learn from that they're going to review and take into Tuesday. I mean, we're all disappointed, and she obviously said that in the huddle, but Yes, it's something to look forward to, obviously, Tuesday. And, I mean, we're preparing for the summer next year, so we've got a long long time to try and improve that. Oh, yeah, to us. Thank you. And the, just on that, uh, the, the, your, your first goal, your, it was your cross. Uh, did you immediately think it was a handball? Uh, I mean, it was quite close, but, yeah, I know it I know it nicked her hand, but obviously I didn't know whether they were going to give it or not. But, yeah, I think we deserved a penalty at that time, especially. And